to set up your ring doorbell you will need to go to your phone that you want to use and go to settings and connections and make sure that your bluetooth is on so when your bluetooth shows on you will go to the app the ring app and then make sure that you are connected with uh, your ring doorbell if it's not connected this is how to connect it you want to make sure to uh, press there's a button at the back of the ring doorbell that orange button there you're gonna go click on that or push that button and then on the app uh, and then sh wait for that white flashing spinning light so once it flashes like that you will be prom prompted in the app and just follow the app and then now it will be so ring doorbell is preparing to connect so you want to make sure that it's connected so it will tell you the instructions so when prompted uh, connect to the ring with wi-fi so i did click on that instruction but that's not it the button is actually at the bottom so there it is <laughs> you see got it and then it will be it will say preparing device and then here is that that uh that prompt not that one on top it says connect to device and you you said you hit okay or yes and then it will take a little bit for the device to connect but uh, you will want to make sure to go log into your Wi-Fi and input your Wi-Fi password. And then once your Wi-Fi password is on, if the device is needing to be updated, it will update once the up, you know, you've entered the password. So it says connecting ring doorbell so it will show you that it will show you the percentage of uh, connection and it will say success so your ring doorbell is now connected but again this one does not show it says offline because i haven't used this doorbell for like it hasn't been connected for like a couple of weeks so uh, it needs to be there's an upgrade on the software so here so i went back in um so logging back in to show you that the software for the ring soft ring um has uploaded the ring front door doorbell has uploaded so that's the update i'm talking about so it's already there and once the update has been um has finished uploading on the ring doorbell you are now able to see the view on the camera which is what is showing right now so we have got that figured out so i'm actually just showing you now the dashboard of the ring app just so you have an idea so it's just an overview of what if you have the ring app that's what your dashboard on the app is you'll see the videos that recorded if there's a movement if you've set it up um to no to notifications for movements or doorbell you will have it there the thing with this is you are going to pay monthly right now i'm paying four dollars and 99 cents uh for the monthly just to record the videos or or like like the if the ring doorbell has been um if if someone is on the door if a motion has been detected it records it right away so i am paying four dollars and 99 four ninety nine a month on that one so um the way ring um sets it up is you will have to pay annual so just be ready but that's just the that's the dashboard that's what you can see it will ask you you know it will show you what available um what other available equipments or like cameras are there and then you are able to set up your payment there you have your account your dashboard and then 
you're able to to look at the settings so you have all that to look into so just a quick view of that so you'll have an idea and i mean so far i've had a good experience with um with this doorbell it does show notifications too like let's say your neighbors that have the doorbell as well you'll have some kind of um way to communicate with each other it doesn't have your name it's just gonna say you know the name the number like some 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 numbers like the serial number probably just your ring number or it doesn't say your address so you're anonymous but again this is how to set up your doorbell for the ring and you i am using an android phone my z flip 6 so you are you should be able to see the same uh, if you have iphones so that's it it's a ring you go to your app go look at the dashboard and then some other informations are there